Hey now. Hey now, hey now, hey now. Let's get the word out. Hey now. Let's get the word out. Hey, hey, the legacy continues, indeed. And I will make sure not to shit my pants. <laughs> yeah. I've been looking forward to getting back into this. Hey, Gray. Greetings from North Carolina. What are you doing in North Carolina? What up, Gray? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Come on now. These beats are so fresh. S snap. Oh, Spanksgiving. <laughs> Yo, what a Moogle. Yo, Alice, North Carolina. Ah, oh, yeah. <laughs> So where are you, are you traveling to North Carolina, or are you going through North Carolina? One's a bad time, one's a really bad time. <laughs> right, let me do my Discord posts. Guess where you're going for Thanksgiving? I, I would imagine the kitchen, Moogle. <laughs> where are you going for Thanksgiving? You know where I'm going for Thanksgiving? Fucking nowhere. It's a pound. No, I, I would imagine, like, honestly, I would imagine the kitchen would be the answer to that. So, yeah, uh, we were, so, thanks. I was already not going, by the way. Hey, B. Maybe. Yeah, have you noticed that um, your follow list is no longer ordered by views? I'm not sure what it's ordered by now, but it's it's in some kind of order. So, I, w I already wasn't going to go to Thanksgiving uh, on Thursday because uh, we will... Okay, the original plan was to have it here, right? And then my sister didn't want to have it here, whatever, right? So, that was the whole thing. So we we're having it at my grandmother's house, right? And uh, yes, as a matter of fact, I actually got a message from the person who was the thousandth follower on Facebook. Uh, it was actually that guy that came in at the very end of the Street Fighter stream yesterday. He let me know that he was my thousandth follower. But but anyway, I, I already wasn't going to go. I was going to stay home with the dogs, and then like mom's going to bring me a plate or something. And I to me, this is fine. She was like, I have to make sure that you're okay with this, you know? And I'm like, I'm very okay with this, because I really don't want to deal with my sister anyway, and I super definitely don't want to deal with my fucking gluten-free aunt. I, I just, I really don't want to deal with her. I really don't need that shit in my life, right? So, um, oh, sorry to hear that. Yeah, sorry to hear that. But, um, speaking of which, Thanksgiving dinner is postponed until Saturday because pretty much everybody over there is sick. Um, uh, hey, Aaron Masa, what's going on? Um, my sister's sick, her, uh, my two nephews are sick, her husband's sick. My grandmother is not sick. The, the 90-year-old woman that lives with them, well, it's her house, uh, only one that's not sick. What do you mean I got a gluten-free aunt, too? I'm the one with the gluten-free aunt. I was the one who started calling her that. 
I'm scared to think of like what your brother's cooking would be, Evie. Yeah, so I'm just gonna stay home. Um, well, now Thursday's nothing special. I mean, I'll be honest, I don't really give a fuck about Thanksgiving anyway. Uh, Saturday is gonna be Thanksgiving dinner, and we don't know if my uncle and my gluten-free aunt are even gonna be coming. Uh, I'm thinking probably not, because they also have their own health problems, and they don't even go to real doctors. So, you know. Yeah, exactly. Exactly. And you know what? If you want to get super stoned, get super stoned. Unfortunately, we are... I, I spoke to June earlier. We're not doing Twilight Zone later. I, I, I asked June... Because, you know, we normally do Twilight Zone on Tuesdays, and we've been off for a few... Uh, a few weeks because June had been traveling and June got home yesterday and I said are you good to do that tonight or do you need more time to recuperate because you like you know you just got home you know like I wouldn't expect June to get home and then do the Twilight Zone stream immediately the next day so June actually said that she would prefer to take tonight to catch up on home movies because she missed that yesterday so you know staying home eating, sipping on some scotch, and bitching on the internet. That's the life right there. Right? But, yeah. Oh, damn. Oh, this? Yo, this is a banger, though. Okay. Yo, this song's the tits. I, well, I don't know. I mean, um... If Alice is going to show it, or she's going to watch it on her own, or, or whatever, but... You know, that's cool. We can wait till next week. Twilight Zone ain't going nowhere. Yo, this song, though. Yeah, I figured Alice, but yeah. But yeah, that, you know, I, I, I talk with you, and I'm like, you know... I didn't expect you to just immediately be like, yes, you gotta do Twilight Zone, it's Tuesday, you're back. And, you know, give her some time to recuperate from all the traveling, you know? But uh, I, I want to start, but I also want to hear the rest of this song. This is Axiom Verge 2 you're listening to. It's going to be the next game I do, by the way, is Axiom Verge 2. I've been looking forward to that. Now that it's actually on Steam and not Epic Game Store. No. Epic Game Store. <laughs> I could throw an eye patch on that for you. Yeah, I mean, we were we were talking about that the other day when I was playing Dragon Quest Eight, and Alice was, found the guy that plays Yangus, and he kind of looks like Yangus. I said, yeah, but he doesn't have that cool MS Paint goatee. You know, like, oh, I was trying to get it before it started another song. All right, um, because you know that shit. Like you said, oh, it's gonna be this shitty goatee, and I looked at it. I'm like, it's actually kind of legit. Like, it actually looks cool. All right, let's play this intro though. No running in the halls! Don't tell me what to do! I'm running in the halls! Ah, fuck the police! I know a BJD is a ball, a ball joint, ball jointed doll, but I'm just thinking it of ball jerk dick. When your last name is Fail, becoming a doctor doesn't even help all that much. He's gonna take this stick and shove it so far up my ass, I'll be singing Christmas songs with it! In the lava you go. Oh shit! I deserve that. Ooh! I don't know what's going on! Hello, I am over-designed McWeirdo. Hi, I'm Create a Character from Soul Calibur. Nice! 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 Work on it, Sten! Yeah, I better respect my trans hormones before I change your pronouns to words were. Bitch. Hey, I've been a bad golem. Oh, yeah, give it to me. Oh, I like it. Oh, oh, yes. Oh, from behind. Hey, now. All right, let's get our Rogue Legacy on. All right, let's see. We've got a Valkyrie, a Mage, and a Barbarian. I like the Barbarian, but I want to try out... Valkyrie. I don't know what that's all about. She got a spear or a halberd or something. Well, it's some kind. It's some kind of pole arm. 
Oh, it's a false shard. Can attack while moving. That's ham. Can aim your attack. So she's Donatello from Teenage Mutant Turtles 1. Ooh, that's good scotch from what I've heard. Can aim your attack. Dash attacks are always skill crits. Okay. You could deflect with... Wa oh, so you got a parry. Okay. Destroy all mid-sized projectiles. Restoring mana. Recharges on hit. And fully recharges on successful counters. Fungal spread. Kangan... Kanganthropy? Like a kangaroo? Alright, let's see what this is all about. XD, 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 turtle power. Alright. Hold on, there's affordable items by the docks. Let's check that out. Alright. Your spin kicks deal 150. Okay, I got it. They never give you enough time to read that shit. So the kangaroo thing is spin kicks deal more damage, but you bounce higher. I fail to see how that's a bad thing, bouncing higher. Anti ring, this ring. For every point of resolve below 125%, deal 1% bonus weapon damage. So basically, lower resolve means more damage. Oh my god, I like the Valkyrie. You can't aim diagonally, though, I'm noticing. You know, I'm not just a blacksmith. I was trained in crafting of large-scale items like armor, plows, and swords. But I learned the skills of a whitesmith, too. Rings, fine tools, and etchings. Smithing isn't just a job to me, it's my blood. Everything I make, I put the utmost care into. So stop complaining about my prices. <laughs> oh, boy. Let's all arm the lesbians. This is new, the Scholar Helm. Well, yeah, I want that. Okay. Do you have anything new? Alright, let's see what upgrades we can get. Woo! If only Eternal Felina was a better game. I mean, you're right, though, right? Put that into that. Enter labor costs. Building castles is tough. Labor costs rise with each upgrade, making each purpose sli purchase slightly more expensive. Consider how you spend your money, but don't fret too much. Inflation can be easily overcome. That's arsenal. It's like a gym, but with <laughs> arse. Hold on a second. There was something that I wanted to work more on. I don't remember what it was, though. It was something I, I started, but... Arse. Was it this? Meditation study. Yeah, definitely this. But I can't afford it right now. Alright, let's do that. And this. Arsenal. Increases strength, weapon, raising weapon damage. Alright. Alright, sweet. Wow, you really do go high. She's like, I go high. Take my money, biatch. We actually did Monster Prom on the Discord a few times. It was fun. Wow, okay, you really do go high like that. I, I failed to see how that's that bad of an idea, though. Oh, man. I like this class. This class is kind of ham. Alright, that's a new area, it looks like, so let's not go that way. Alright, where's that dash button? There it is. Alright, alright. Whoa, watch out. Nah. Also nah. Oh wait, and I got that ability, that bat? Okay. I gotta... And what is this? Oh, that's cool. That's, that's kind of crazy. Alright. Alright, hold on. Ah! I think I got him. I'm trying to be careful here. 
Jesus. Oh, that's right, I could break the motherfuckers. Why am I doing it the stupid way? Oh god, watch out. I gotta remember how this game works. Hard out, Alucard. Oh, you already kind of maxed all that out, huh? Watch out. Nah, fam. Hey, four dollars. Is it different from Rogue Legacy? What do you mean? It's very different from Rogue Legacy. This is Rogue Legacy 2. It's the sequel. Watch out. Oh, God. Oh, no. Oh, God. I thought I could make it. Ah, I thought I could make it again. What is wrong with me? Four dollars. Wait, wait for it. got here a skeleton key or the serrated handles bargain deal and take a hundred percent I don't know about all that let's see what this is all about rare relic open locked or melted fairy chest breaks after use okay cool Oh god, what is wrong with me? I thought he was going to be dead there. Liam was like the nebbish guy, right? Oh, that's right. Dash attacks are good when you're uh, this character. I gotta remember that. Gotta remember, dash attack. This might be my favorite character so far, is the Valkyrie. <laughs> okay, that's funny. Um, I take damage, 90 cent, but I can get my max hit points. Yeah, I think I'm going to do this. Right? Because I can maybe get that health back. That's the first time I've taken that deal. Oh god. Oh, this is the boss, ain't it? Alright, I want to see if I can find a way to replenish. Well, then again, I do have that ability that replenishes health when I go into a boss chamber. Maybe I should just go in there. Right? Let's try it. 
Wait, how does that work? Like this? Oh, wait, it's already open. I don't need to open it again. Oh, yeah, it gave me a lot of health back, actually. Because we haven't managed to beat this guy here. You're even really come close. Alright, here we go. Estuary Lamech, the first spell sword. Ah, well. Damn it. No, oh, don't do that. Watch out. Oh god. Remember that he does that. Watch out. Okay, we're going into a second phase, apparently. Oh no. No! Oh man. Yeah, it is like a Hollow Knight boss. That was good though! That was a good attempt. I was doing pretty good. I just didn't know like the new patterns and stuff, but yo, the Valkyrie is ham. I didn't rank her up though. That was a really good attempt. Oh, I gotta do another Valkyrie, right? Medium and Algezia, and I got Blaze Bellow. Okay. Yo, that deflect? Yeah. Yeah, that was that was a really good attempt. I'm happy about that. Hmm. Okay. Yeah, Moogle's like, guess where I'm going for Thanksgiving? I'm like, I don't know, the fucking kitchen? <laughs> like, <laughs> I mean, that's what I would imagine. Y'all, the Valkyrie is... You know how, like, I really cottoned on to... What was the one that I really liked in Rogue Legacy 1? I think it... The Lich King? The Lich King was awesome. Oh, what's my uh, tra trait? You can see through the veil of the living and the dead, and it's kind of dumb. Everything is spooky. In Algezia, I get more gold. No immunity window after taking damage, though. Okay. Every day's a furry event for Moogle. Oh, it's sad that that's true. Well, watch out. Hmm. I feel like I could take that boss now. I'm, I'm, you know what I'm saying? Like, Okay, so it's just everything's pumpkins. <laughs> That's kind of cool, though. I ain't gonna lie. Can I... Okay. I'm gonna test a theory. Oh, that's not how you test that theory. Alright, ne never mind, never mind. There'll be other... Other opportunities. I have had those same thoughts. Oh, enemies look spooky too. It's cool. It becomes the Halloween game. Watch out. 
Oh, I gotta try this spell, though. Watch out. Oh, it's that? Okay. It does work. Okay. I mean, we're all a certain flavor of weirdo, right? So dash attacks that give you the stats can be, uh, the, the extra attack can be up or down too, right? That's what I'm noticing. Like I can just, hold on me. Come on. See, so you can get us like that. He got a pig mask on, yo. Damn it. Yeah, you mentioned it. You're like, oh, this is why we can't have nice things, right? <laughs> uh, let's try over here. A challenge, huh? Let's do it. Good dog. Good God. Oh, jump up there. Well, why couldn't I do... Oh, that's why. That could have been better. Oh my god. Damn. Taking a lot more damage here than I, uh, yeah. I do have no invincibility window, yeah. Well, I guess I would have liked to take a nap, and I'm gonna take this. I got no iframes, but uh, there's a good thing to it. Um, I get more money. So, plus 55% health. What do we have here? Twin Ivy Roots. Deal 25% bonus damage while on the ground. Ivy Seed. Um, I, you know what? I don't know what that is. I know this is good, though. You know what I'm saying? And I got the resolve, so I might as well take it. Hell yeah! Awesome. Watch out. Hey, found the boss! Look what I found, a scholar chest blueprint. This game is awesome. I would definitely recommend it. All right, let's fight this asshole. Oh. I was on cooldown. God damn it, I forget he does that. Oh no, that's really bad. Get out of there. Oh. Watch out. 
Watch out. Okay. Oh, damn. Damn it! I was on cooldown again. Watch out. And the second part. Fuck the spell, just hit him. Oh, all right. Ah, oh, I didn't press the right button. Okay, good attempt though, and I ranked her up. I ain't mad about that. All right, so we got a ranger, a mage, and a barbarian. I think I'm probably gonna take the barbarian because of the plus 275% gold. No immunity window after taking damage, but still, one hit wonder. Wait, I got one health? I have to try it, right, just to gain money? Just to gain money, I gotta do it. Like, don't even try to fight the boss. Just go and get money. Get money and bitches, right? It ain't gonna matter, exactly. None of this matters. So it says, Etching Chamber is a sacred ground where squid goop is used to inscribe ancient symbols into human flesh. Max rune weight capacity. All right. So I have exactly one health. Just see how much money I can get, right? Oh, I already had the scholar Oh, here it is, scholar chest. Oh, I don't have the money for that. All right. Hold, hold on. So basically the first time I get hit, it's over, right? The run's over as soon as I get hit. Maybe, uh, we get a lot of money. Yo, Alice, thank you for the thousand bits. Thank you so much. Yo, the pride bits, too. Problems. Oh, that was money there. Shit. Watch out. I can remember how to play this barbarian, too. Yeah, I'm basically just collecting money. I'm not bothering with anything else. Watch out, watch out. Okay. Yo, and Ross, thank you for the thousand bits as well. Y'all looking to start Hive Train, I swear. That's what's gonna... Wait, chill, chill, don't do that. I know what to do here. Thank you. Thank y'all. Whoa, watch out. What's the spell, anyway? Oh, it's that. Okay. Watch out. Wait for it. Huh. Hi, Gibbs. That was not a good time to surprise me like that. Oh, not getting that. Nope. That's not what I was trying to do, but okay. I'll do it. Whatever. Oh, my God. Time to bring out Sabin? What are we gonna... Um... Hi, Gibbsy. Could you lay down or n not be here? Hi. You're so cute. Now... Good boy, good boy. Now, lay, either lay down or get out of here. You're, you're, you're like right up in my face. Are we gonna body slam a fucking... Train? That's also a ghost? Oh, suplex the hype train. I get... Huh. 
Uh. Fuck off. I don't know how many of it is. One, two, three, four, five hundred. It's we got a hype train, y'all. Stickles, 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 stickles. <laughs> oh God! Wait, d this doesn't matter, does it? I can't. Yeah, no matter what, I, either either one of those is. I could restore mana if I wanted to, but what does it matter? The tech. Oh. Okay. <laughs> I thought you were doing helicoptering. Boop, 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 boop. You know, like the naked salsa dance. Oh my god, eighth in here with a lot of bits. 1,500 bits, thank you so much, guys, y'all. <laughs> I think I'm gonna have to buy some Christmas presents. That's what y'all, oh god, I thought that was gonna hit me. I thought the run was over right there. That doesn't matter. Okay, okay, wait for it, wait for it. Yo, level two hype train right off the bat. That's here, you know that shit's ham. Whoa, I didn't know that guy was there. Oh, that's, uh, well, you know. <laughs> a lot of money, though. Almost ranked him up, too. Yo. Yo, actually, we're at level three. Setting a new record. Keep going till the clock runs out. Holy shit, y'all. Oh. Oh, I mean, a Valkyrie, hello? Yes. I like the Valkyrie. Wait, what are my traits? I got Poison Bump. Fungal? We're gonna find out what Fungal is. She Fungal. Plink dead. Yep, that's how it'd be. It do be like that. Hold on now. You really like mushrooms. Is that it? It's just you like mushrooms? I hate mushrooms. You really like mushrooms. Cool! We like mushrooms. Uh... Now we can get that. No, I don't want to equip, don't equip all gear. Yo, Alice, thank you for gifting that sub to Ray. Ray will be quite chuffed to hear that as well. Um, let's do this as much as I can. Ross, thousand bits. Let's keep that train going. Oh my god, I think we're I think we're maxing it out. I think we're maxing this bitch out, y'all. Yeah, hundred percent. All the emotes are falling all. Over. I don't know if if you guys are seeing the same thing that I'm seeing. It's like hype. Everything's going insane on, on the screen. It's amazing. Level three complete. That might bring you to level. That might bring you up more than level three. Let's see. Two percent. Okay. And level four. Wow. Y'all, y'all just opening your hearts today, and it means a lot to me. Like I said, this is gonna be able to to make sure that I could, you know, buy Christmas presents. And that's, you know, I already bought for the nephews, but there's other things, you know. All right, this Valkyrie, I feel it. I feel it in my bones. This is gonna be the one that finally kills that guy, right? Oh, okay, wait. Is that, it's Super Mario Brothers, but I'm big. Is that good that I'm big? Wait, you just, bro, what? I'm into it. Let's see what's down here. Oh, let's see, we've got Skeleton Key or Cosmic Key. Insight. I'm gonna do this because I don't know what it is. And I'm kind of curious. Gain 100 mana when hurt. Mana gain an overcharge. Hello? What? That's amazing. And that's... So I could... Oh, this sounds good. Oh, so I could just... Bro, that sounds crazy good. Caron's trial. Oh, the trials are good, right? We want to trial Hermes boots. Hermes boots. We know Hermes boots is good, but I gotta try a trial, right? That's still good, though. All right. So we gotta kill like ten enemies, right? To get that going, right? Oh, I don't know where it shows. Here it is. All right. Until purified, any t hit taken is fatal. We have to kill 15 enemies to purify it. We get 20% to gold, ore, and 
Ether. Oh my god, EB, thank you for gifting that sub to Masa. Errant Masa, you got a sub. Enjoy your emotes. Thank you so much, EB. So we had to kill 15 enemies, but at least we're at the beginning where that might be doable. I'm not fucking with that when I, I'm at one health here. Oh god. Th this makes me big, though. I don't know that that's good. I, that counts, right? Hopefully that counts. I don't know being big when I'm trying to not get hurt. Oh wait, hold on, there's some enemies coming at me. Here we go, here we go, here we go, watch out. Oh, he can't get to me, huh? Watch out. It has a running counter over the trials icon. Where is that? Oh, th is that the 12 near my life bar? Wait, hold on. Hmm. Bottom left, the three in the bo- Oh, okay. I see. Oh, but I can't... Not when I'm big like that. Oh, no. Oh, God. There wasn't much point to that, was there? Fuck! I hit my head on the freaking ceiling. <laughs> oh, well. I've yet to pass one of those trial. What is this? A new contract signed. A new successor chosen. Yeah, it does be like that. I don't know what that was all about, but okay. Oh, okay, cool, another Valkyrie. White Star is a spell, and Forgetful gives you more gold. Dropped items will disappear after for a period. Okay, more gold, but stuff disappears quickly. I can't. I didn't get. I didn't get much there. I've had that trait before. Yo, Alice with. Oh my God! One, two. It's it's. Like 500 and somewhat bits. Thank you so much, Alice. Yo, keeping it going. We're at 46% towards, well, as high as it goes. 510, thank you. Thank you for the 510 bits. And I just got a level 3 hype train emote. Let's share that. Oh my god, it's cute though. It's fucking cute. All time record shattered. You've reached new levels of support. 46% at level 4. I know that's not an all-time record, because we've had f level 5, but still amazing. Choo-choo! Isn't that cute, though? Who else got it? I know, well, Ross would have gotten it. Alice, you would have gotten it. Eighth, and Eevee, you got it. Amazing. What's this spell like? Okay, that's cool, though. I'm into it. Everybody gets laid. No. There was one kind of recently that was really, really big that we went all the way to level five. Oh, that'll hurt me? Okay, good to know. Thank you for letting me know that, Aeth. Oh, God. Ew. Oh, you can just dash like that against a wall and do that. That's almost, that's almost too good. All right, we got that. Explosions, no, not friend or foe. That, that's good advice for real life, right? Hmm. Thank you guys so much for the hype train. That always gets me super... Well, there's no better word for it than hype. Watch out. I'm not a one-hit point wonder anymore, but still...
still don't want to get hit, right? Let's see what's down here. Watch out. Oh god. It's a Chungus. Wait. Don't leave him there too long. Alright. Hype train is better than the Yeet bus. Uh, you're not wrong. You're not wrong at all. Oh, I sh can't get that money now. Alright. Okay, it's fine. Ooh, hello. Watch out. I love the way this Valkyrie handles. Holy crap. It's like how much I like the Lich King or Lich Queen in uh, the previous game. This is amazing. Yeet bus might be better than the Revenant bus. I mean, probably. Looks like we have something going on here. We have Freon's Reward. Opening chest restores health. All poisons have their uses, some more than others. Or the serrated handles bargain, deal end to- Nah, I don't like that. Well, we'll take this. Another free ends. Does this stack? Yeah, it does, it looks like. But what's this? Atropos' scissors? That always sounds good. Is Atropo- Hey, Sarah. Is Atropos' scissors good? Because, like, that- If it's anything like the real Atropos' scissors from mythology, it should be, like, a really good thing. You're telling me this entire orchestra is Siberian and trans? It's good if a situational one? What does it do, do you know? I mean, opening chest healing you seems pretty ham. I already got it, but it, it stacks, though. But I kind of want to know what this does. Plus damage to crits. Oh, and I can crit anytime I want with this character. Exactly. I'm taking it. Critical damage from spells and weapons increased by 20%. So, I mean, that's a crit right there, right? Each of these, whenever you see a golden slash, that's a crit. So, yo, Valkyrie, Valkyrie ham, no, Valkyrie kind of nice. See what I'm talking about? Mmm, crit. Uh, 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 uh. Uh, uh, uh. Wait, don't be doing that. Hold on. Not that I need to replenish health, but I want the money. Yeah, it seems really good. out. Oh god, I didn't know that was going to be a thing. It's alright, it's alright, it's alright. And there's always chests right outside a boss battle, too. Ugh. Oh god, watch out. Mmm, fuck off. Mmm, double fuck off. I want that. Siberian Katru. I don't know why I just said it. it's the name of a guest song. Oh god. Alright. 
this that looks like that's where I've been. Let's go down here. All right, I don't have much resolve though. Mammon's bounty and cloak of even. I think I'm gonna leave that because I I'm at 100% resolve and I'm not looking to lose health. Oh wait, I want that. Um, I don't know the exact formula, but it has to do with how much. Braid rope or whatever it's called. Okay. See, there's a chest down there, but let me see what's up here first. Nah, nah, what are you doing? Alright. Let's go get that chest. The Frayed Ends of Sanity. Sweet! Being able to move while attacking is so good. Bro, what? Oh, I probably could have... I can get up there. Hmm. But I don't think I can actually get up there. Nah. Well, I opened it, but... There wasn't much point to that. Wait, I can go down here. I shouldn't have, uh, watch out. Oh god. I shouldn't have broken those boxes. I didn't notice the fake wall right away. Yeah. You live, you learn, right? Hey, the boss! We're gonna... I'm gonna go and fucking merc this dude. Wait, let's merc this man. I don't have a lot of magic, but... I can replenish it pretty quickly. Oh, you're just gonna dash at me right, right, right away like that? All right. Watch out, chill. Watch out, and. Did hit me. Uh oh, watch out. I misunderestimated how much that explosion was going to be. Oh god, wrong button. Watch out, and... Oh, oh. Oh no! I'm almost got this guy. Hold on to that for me. You're dead! Is our children learning? Y'all mer- I knew it was gonna be with the Valkyrie. As soon as I saw what this character was like, I'm like, we gotta play that. Yo, Ray, I don't know if you noticed you got a gift sub. How do I- Oh, right, there we go. 
four dollars and I got spells and swords. Bitched. <laughs> One out of six bosses destroyed. Awesome. That was fucking amazing. Oh, look. This guy's here. Thank you for putting Estuary Lamech to rest. Regardless of what he's done, he deserved a warrior's death. I'll agree with that. What do we have here? Gravity beam? You know what? Um, I actually like the, uh, what I have. So, no. Watch out. I mean, that's just a hype beam. That's like Shinku Hadoken, right? Oh, I can't. I really can't hit that man. All right. Oh, Valkyrie's my gal, though. Absolutely, yeah. I, I, I think I just like what I have too much right now. I mean, it was instrumental in doing that. Oh, I, okay, I didn't see it. I just want to make sure that you notice that you gotta... Watch out. Whee! Must kill Mo. Alright. Anything new here now that I've done that? No, okay. Oh, that meat disappeared, damn. That's my bad. Alright, let me see what this area... Because there's an area that's like two stars, but I don't know which direction it would be in. This is two star. Okay, so we'll, we'll want to come back here, in other words. But let me try and finish out the rest of the citadel. You know, for grindage purposes. Huh. Well, I ain't getting that, but it's cool. Anything else? I guess down there and over there, yeah. Yeah, exactly. That's why I was like, oh, uh, let's just see, right? That way I can always teleport. Oh, wait, not this way. Oh, but you can do that in future runs, you're saying? Yo, that's ham, though. Just for this run? Oh, okay, cool. That's less ham, but it's still still good that I could do that. Uh, we're gonna oh, we're gonna go up here. Okay. this wasn't completely finished. Don't get hit. Open me. Destroy all con. Oh well. That was whack anyway. And then there's down there. Roasted salmon with miso rice and ginger scallion and vinaigrette. That sounds good. We had um, beef and macaroni, nothing crazy. You know, it was really good though. I sure ate a lot. Now 
let's see what's over here. Watch out. And the chest refilled my health, yeah. Oh, they're gross. Ugh. That's rough. You want it to at least taste good, right? If it's <laughs> if it's gonna not work, you want it to taste good, right? So I guess I'll head to the the, the warp that's kind of not too far from here, and we'll go to the we'll, we'll find out what this new area is all about, right? Hmm. Merc the shit out of that boss, though. Yeah. Wait. Oh, that's a new area too, but that's not what I've decided I'm doing. Beer float. <laughs> yeah. Doesn't sound too good. Uh, uh, you just chill out right there. There are secrets everywhere. What? Ah, telling me to do it. Some heirlooms are hidden. A Garth Gatehouse. Do not leave. Oh, yeah, yeah, I remember this. Oh, okay. I know how to get up there. Okay, hold on. Oh, come on. I know I can. Oh, 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 okay. I don't know that I have to do this or not, but I'm doing it. Yeah, did I do this already, or... I think Ace might have had me do something with... Yeah. Ace, I did this, right? I don't think I need to do this again. Oh, okay. So I haven't done this. All right, let's let's try then. All right. Stairwells, co Gregory. Stairwells collapsed. No way to get up there now. These wretched black roots are probably the cause. Must have wormed their way into the cracks. I can, I can make that jump. Maybe I can't. I can do this, though. That's what I'm going for, it looks like. I'm not getting up there. Alright, I suspected I'd have to take the outside path. Would have been nice to have done it without getting hit, but, you know... Insight resolved. Shrouded ambitions. Location discovered. Echo's heirloom. Hey, buddy. You want to take my challenge, right? Right? Come on. You got to take the challenge, man. I've been stuck up here for so long. Like, you have no idea. Just try it once. Just the tip. See how it feels. What's the worst that can happen? It's so easy. Buddy, listen. If you win, I promise you my power of resonance will be totally worth it. Full stop. No joke. You have no idea how worth it this is. So come on. Come on, let's get going. Come on. Absolutely. Insight discovered. Volunteer duty. Okay. Your spin kicks have been upgraded into echo kicks. Alright. What does that mean? Echo kicks can strike resonance objects and projectiles. Oh. All right, all right, sweet. Only Geese is posted something bold. How bold are we talking? Oh, finally they reset dashes. It should have done. It should have done that to begin with. But I was thinking it's like, oh, it's like, uh, hold on. I, was, I wanted it to be like Hollow Knight, and it wasn't. You know. Now it is like Hollow Knight. Lugia is a goot. That is bold. Hmm. 
Okay, I see what I'm doing. Okay. Yikes, y'all. Resident enemies can only hurt by echo kicks. Okay. Echo kicks can strike resonance objects and projectile. We, we know that. Oh, I see what I... Okay, watch out. Watch out, watch out. Oh, God, really? Okay. What do I kick as, as I come out? Ow! Oh, the, the projectile! Maybe, maybe, maybe that is the mythical goose Pokemon that we've been looking for. Shit! Oh yeah, buddy, you did it. Thanks for getting me out of there. Now let's start kicking stuff and having ourselves a party. Is Lugia a goose? Spin kick now resets dashes and destroys resonant projectiles. I wanted it to, cause I thought it would be like Hollow Knight, right? I wanted to reset dash, and now it does. Awesome. Looters be warned. As decreed by Estuary Irad, that must be our next boss, all gold and jewelry found in Axis Mundi's property of the treasury. All looting is strictly prohibited. You will gain additional 20% gold bonus while in Axis Mundi. Nice. Gregory's memory. These temporary residence platforms we've made are a fool's errand. There are not enough volunteers with Echo's heirloom to make the crossing, and every person we lose is a sacrifice we can't afford. The estuaries are right. There's no saving the villagers. Okay. Yeah, fuck that guy. Watch out. Okay, that's just... Okay, I get it. Uh. Uh. But there's a chest up there that I want to get, huh? God damn, watch out. God damn, god damn, put the bacon in the pan. Alright, we got it, we got it, we got it. Uh. Give me my health. What an asshole. Oh, really? Okay. What's up here? Okay. Another challenge, huh? Let's try it. Dude, watch out. Got it. Do not taunt the bouncy fun ball. I gotta go with this. Glowing ember. Azure edges. I don't think so. Ooh. I hope it's something good, right? Like, I'm sure it will be good. Now all we gotta do is hopefully find enough chest to replenish health more. All right, we gotta go through here. Watch out. Earthen Mall, huh? Ugh. What 
crates and barrels. Well, I want to get that, though. I didn't see any other crates and barrels, but... You talking about back here? Well, I guess there's this, no? That's about all I'm saying. Oh, wow. Well, I'm not worried about it. Inspired by Super Mario 64 and <laughs> the Hitman series? I mean, it might as well be, right? Is this whole area, like, just one long thing? Oh, watch out. Alright. Hmm. Alright. Oh no! Ah. It looks like I, there. Okay, I, I'm. It looks like there's a platform there, but I guess there isn't. Hey, Jake. Whew. Yeah, it looks like there's a platform, but. Mm. Oh, what? Watch out. Whoa, okay. Oh, God, stop. There is a chest back there, though. Damn it! I think I can do this, but I gotta... Ah! Yeah, I bet. There we go. I'm like, I know I can get up there. Look at that, a warden weapon. Alright, nice blueprint. It's just weird that instead of it being like a maze, it just seems to be one long thing going forward, you know? No, I pressed the button, but all right. See what we got here. Oh, I don't need to. All right. Well, I don't really have the resolve for any of this stuff. And I like my long health bar right now. I didn't know that was going to happen. like Guan Yu. Oh no, I remember these things from Rogue Legacy 1. Okay. Oh. 
He's got nothing to say. He's like, I'm going back to Hollow Knight, bitches. Pizza girl? Hey there, stranger. Didn't I didn't think I'd meet anyone this far up, but I'm sure glad you started up. Name's Maria, by the way. What? I was heading out to Sun Tower when a shift happened and some monsters teleported right beside me. So I ran back here to my pizza shop and decided to lay low until they left. Or until someone got rid of them. Thanks for that, by the way. Anyway, I can tell from your getup that you're not from around here. Just a wild guess, but you're from above, right? Trying to open that giant gold door? Don't worry, I won't pry. Just saying that maybe I can help. If you ever get the chance, come meet me by one of the teleporters. Maybe we can work together. Thanks again for the save, but I better be going. I'd like to study the teleporters while I still have the chance. Pizza girl unlocked. It's a pizza party. Delivering pizza is tough. Delivering pizza is an ever-changing world is tougher. The pizza girl will now help you on your journey. Spoilers, it has nothing to do with pizza. There's a fetish for everything. You're right. I know, I know, Alice. I'm, like, restraining myself as well. I can see that up there goes into another area. I'm kind of curious to at least see what it's called and maybe get a teleporter, but... Sun Tower, and that's five star. Okay, yeah, no, I'm good. The pizza has no preservatives. What a manic. Wait, I should talk to her? Okay, hold on. Feels like I just got done talking with her, but I'll talk to her again. Hey again, stranger! So you're interested in hearing my proposal? How exciting. I was afraid you'd ghost me. Your lack of response and facial expression makes you quite hard to read. First, let me do a proper introduction. Name's Maria, pizza delivery girl by day, amateur geologist by night. Don't let my job title fool you. Delivering food isn't easy when everything keeps shifting. One wrong step and you can end up be being the toppings. But I'm different. I can feel the shift and I can tell when things have moved and where they'll end up. And that's how you and I can work together. See this portal? It's bound to other portals via currents. Once a portal is activated, you can keep going back to it. But if a shift occurs, that connection is lost. Yeah, I'll be streaming on Thanksgiving. Gotta play that. I mean, it, everybody eats Thanksgiving dinner at like 3 p.m. anyway. I've been studying these portals and using them for deliveries for a while now, so I've grown pretty attuned to the currents. And if you give me enough resources, I think I can unlock these portals for you permanently. Okay. What's in it for me, you didn't ask? Well, if I can keep these portals open, then I can start helping others who are stuck because of them. Not everyone can cross these treacherous regions on their own, so having these portals would be a literal lifesaver. You making some salad? What kind of salad are you making? So what do you say? You get to traverse the world more easily, and I get to help people in need. All it takes is 1,500 gold. I mean, I think I, I got that. Yeah, do it. Perfect. That's exactly what I needed. And just like that, it's done. Portal unlocked. This portal is now permanently available for future runs. Oh, okay. All right. No, I'm not hanging out in this area, but... Eh, interesting. So that way you can skip the first area. Yeah, okay. I get it. Oh, but wait, I have an idea. Yeah, not only that, but... Spring greens, goat cheese, walnuts, and straw... That sounds good. I'll need 1,500 gold to permanently unlock this teleporter. Yep, go ahead. Perfect, it's exactly what I needed, and just like that, it's done. Just saying. You can't unlock the throne room or special rooms? Okay. Oh, I'm sorry to hear that, Evie. You should eat some food to sort of, like, help settle your stomach, I think. See what we got in here. Okay. Whoa. Like, guess what I'm doing? Where? Guess where I'm? He said, "Guess where I'm going on Thanksgiving." I'm like, I don't know, the fucking kitchen. Like, oh, it's got shields.
Damn. It went somewhere. I don't think it's dead. It might be dead. I don't know. Oh! I thought I can stand on that. Thanksgiving. You know what? I can avoid that whole mess by... Oh, I was going to say by doing this. I see exactly what I gotta do. Oh god, that's not what I'm trying to do. Oh. Oh yeah! Step into a Slim Jim. Oh god. Money, 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 money! Money, money, money! I was like, I see how I can make this a thing. Oh god. Ooh, watch out. Alright, we got this shit. I, do, I really don't remember Money Train. I remember that it existed, but I don't remember if I've seen it or what. Ooh. Mm. Delicious meats. Jesus. What about Money Pit? I think those are called NFTs now. Oh wait, that's gonna vanish. Uh. He's like, all I want is bang, bang, bang. Order in the court, bitch. Damn it. Like, I remember that the movie exists? Watch out. Ah! I can totally do this. Wait, what am I thinking? Don't do that. See what's here. Jay, it's worse than I imagined. The shops, the houses, the fallout of war is all that dwells in them now. We don't have enough hands to cart supplies. Most of the soldiers are so exhausted from dredging the lake, they can barely stand. I know I'm pushing pa them past their limits, but there's no time for rest. If the lake becomes poisoned, well, that would be the final nail in our coffin. Oh, I did not notice that. Oh, hello. I didn't realize those are resonant, but yeah, you're right. Nice that guy to ooh, tell me where he's going before he goes there. Oh, God.
Wait, that's all that's here, huh? Stealth. I remember seeing the trailer for that. It's as far as it went. Never saw the movie. Kerguelen Gatehouse. Please keep all metals off of the soil. Please do not cut any branches while walking through the undergrowth. Please do not disturb the wildlife. Check for breakable walls and fairy chests. All right, give me a minute. Uh... I mean, I don't see anything that looks breakable. To be honest with you. Maybe right here? I'm gonna try it. Nah. This looks like it's the boss. No chests or anything. I was hoping for there to be chests there, maybe up here. There's a small hole in the wall that bypasses the gates. The route is narrow and the drop is steep. If you go through, it's a one-way trip. I'm not going through then. Let me just take a look in here real quick. Oh, oh, you can't. Okay. Alright, let's see what the deal is. Fighting a boss that I've never seen before. Alright, here we go. Void Beast Bjarreth, the Legion. Hold on. Oh, watch out. Alright. Oh, he brought his buddy with him? Oh, God. Nope. What? How is it that easy? Void Beast defeated. That wasn't the actual second boss, was it? Oh, I got Captain and Crew. Maybe it was. Damn, that was fucking free. Yeah, look at that. That was free. Yo, two bosses in one run. Let's fucking go. That was free as hell. Insight resolved. Monster at the by the gates. Entrance unsealed. Some plateau. All right. I'm well past my prime. I would never have stood a chance against those beasts. You have my thanks. All right. Let's see what this is, real quick. Well, this would be the next area I want to do it. Three stars. Kerguelen Plateau. That was so easy. Oh yeah. Unlock this shit. Unlock that shit for sure. Yo, what up, Wayne? Yeah, he threw his big boner at me. Big boner.
dry here, because that's where I'm at. Oh god, watch out. Well, I'm not gonna... Dude, Obelisk, that's a fucking butt plug! Let me go back this way. Oh, that slows you down. I didn't notice that because I was in the air before. He was helicoptering. Plants versus zombies ass looking motherfucker. Hmm. Hmm. Okay, I see that. Huh. Four dollars. Watch out. Oh. Lamps. Ooh, watch out. Oh. No. Did I saw them glowing that time? Nama's memory. Only father believed in me. If not for him, my brothers would have sacrificed me years ago. No farms, no mills, no hunting. Everything must stay in its natural state. We took over the land, and the land cared for us. The yields were kept small, and the forest remained untamed. And due to my wisdom and efforts, my garden has blossomed. In this land of death, I have birthed a cornucopia of life. Do not till the earth, for it will drain the soil. Do not pen the animals, lest sickness spread on light among the livestock. Do not cut the young bough, for their growth enriches the land. Tend to the forest as I tend to my own children. Take only that which is needed. Harvest only that which is dead or dying. Always call the poison. Always. Oh, hello. Risen my ass. Watch out. Damn it. I don't want any Oreos. Leave me all alone. Arise, chicken. Chicken, arise. Billywitchdoctor.com. Mostly comfortable with chicken. Let me hit him back into the thing. You know, hello, meat. Meat! Oh, okay. Damn it. I'm out of there.
Sometimes wall meat will be wall pizza. It heals you for a lot more. Nice. Alright, and I've got Ammonite Helm. Wall pizza. Hello. So those just grow, huh? I thought an enemy was doing that shit. I thought the wizards were doing that. A wizard did it. Whenever you notice something like that, a wizard did it. Watch out. Oh. oh, I don't like these guys. Letter is old and has been carefully wrapped in leather to protect it from the cold. Dear Z, you must be more careful. Talk of the rebellion is spreading. Some estuaries may be deaf to such whispers, but those in the study bear hear everything. As a result, we were ordered to cast the heirloom of Zephyr into the Stygian waters to prevent rebels such as yourself from reaching it. But all is not lost. A recent shift churned up the riverbed, and the heirloom has resurfaced slightly off the far shores. I know how important that heirloom is to you, so I have tethered a resonant rope to just to it just below the waterline. You should be able to reach it from the shore. I can't protect you forever, so good luck and stay low. Oh, okay, I got you. Yeah, that makes sense. Insight discovered. Far shores. What is the far shores, though? Probably an area I haven't been to. Hmm. Well, I want to get that. Oh, there's one that come down. All right. That's uh sure fun. I don't think I'm getting that. Yeah, not without a double jump or something. Oh, right. Oh, but that's... Okay. Flappy Noodle. those guys too often. Hold on, I want magic back. Oh, I didn't hit. Uh-oh. Damn it. That wasn't that great. I'm doing pretty good, but I'm trying to get health back and it's not working all that well. Yeah, I'll get used to it. Another challenge? Mine as well. Okay. Damn it. Watch out. Ah! No, he got me. Oh, well. 
That was amazing. Rank two. Yo, what a good run that was. Look at all this. Look at all this. That was a boss. Rank three. That was like the coolest fucking run. Hey, everybody want to talk to you, huh? Rank four. Let's give me extra quit rate. I know I can make this go faster, but I'm fascinated by it because it was such a long run. Okay. Is that it? You're maxed on experience? You can't get any more experience? There's, a, there's like a hard cap per run, maybe? All right, now we'll make it go faster. It looks like you're hard capped there. A barbarian, ranger, or mage. I think, uh... Right. Let's try this ranger. Oh, it counted the XP faster than the money. Okay. Gotcha. What's up? Yes. Look at that. I've skipped several. Oh, yeah. Chunky. Too heavy to wear. Increase your weight allowance. All right. That's like... I forget where that is. That's gold gain. Encum encumbrance. Right? Encumbrance limits? I don't know. Is this? I don't think that's it. I don't think that's the weight limit. It would have to be something that I've already put a little bit into, no? Or is that it? It says increases encumbrance limits. You have to hit the encumbrance limit to get more weight limit raising. Oh, okay. And this is Taylor's, okay. Alright, let me come here. I don't think I've had anything for her in a while, huh? Yeah. Those seem to be fairly rare compared to other things. Alright, let's see. The dance hall unlocks duelists. Alright. Hats on helmets. <laughs> Stab, jab, and dance around your foes to turn those chumps into lumps. Duelists are all about finesse. Dodge attacks, then dish out damage with a 1-2 combo attack. Only fairy chess, okay. Wait, I think I just X I, I think I just swapped to it. I didn't mean to do that, but alright. Jim increases dexterity, alright. I hated that movie. I still do. I, I have no interest in it. Assassins? Alright. Three hit wonder, two blades, three strikes. Assassins put the sass in sass. Wow. Train in the art of three-hit combo and only the three-hit combo. So they play like zero for Mega Man X is what it sounds like. Assassins are all about getting in and then getting out after hitting the com target three times. No. All right. I think I already changed classes. Yoga class. I'm just like unlocking things. All right. All right. So I'm this now. Oh, God. All right. So let's see. What do we got? Combat role is my talent. Recharges over time. So, that's not a combat. Well, that's a combat roll. Alright. Interesting. Everybody looks sexy in yoga pants. Tell me something about this. Mm, I like it up here. You know, if it wasn't for all the monsters and the danger and the monsters, these docks would be pretty nice. Plus, I'm getting a nice wood tan. Alright, you were not helpful. Wait, what's this? Oh, 
Oh, it's the library. The Karis? Hello, Traveler, and welcome to the Soul Shop. Welcome to the Attic. My name is Karis, and then the rambunction one here is my little sister, also named Karis. I'm the real Karis. Our location is not ideal, but our wares are the highest caliber. What we offer is only for the most discerning of customer. No window shopping. If you wish to peruse our catalog, then please note we only trade in souls. No ore, no ether, and especially none of that mundane gold our brother loves so much. Estuary souls taste the spiciest. <laughs> There's your other job was. Rather than material goods, our shop sells the most valuable item of all, the power of potential. You'll still need to put some elbow grease to make yourself shine, but that... But as they say, power without perseverance is no power at all. Embroidered investments. Higher level equipment can now be found. Yeah. Runic horizons. Higher level runes. Unbreakable will. Increases the max level for the following skills. It all seems worth it. Oh, I wasn't sleeping. Oh, it's just you. Hello, Traveler. Glad you finally can make it. Welcome to the Drift House, our cozy little world between worlds. Name's Garrus, and I'm the caretaker of souls. I believe you've already had the pleasure of meeting my brother, Charon. Tall, dark, not much of a talker. Oh, please don't take any offense from his silent treatment. He's young and going through the rebellious phase. Me, on the other hand, I love to talk. Love it. I'm all about understanding the human condition. Can't get enough of it. I'm also a bit narcoleptic, so before the sweet embrace of sleep takes me away, let's talk shop. This is the Drift House, home of the Gathonic Goods. The house is an anchor, a point of land between our drifting worlds. It exists both nowhere and everywhere. All of our Gathonic beings have our own duties to uphold. Some ferry the dead, others tend to the souls. You get the idea. It's a lot of work, but I love it. And while we may be gods, we're not omnipotent. Even gods occasionally need the help of mortals, you know? And that's where you come in. You help me, you help you. If you're interested, then let's stop the chit-chat and get down to work. Alright, Mending Erebus. Learn about the Scars of Erebus. My narcolepsy could strike any time, just warning you. Oh, these are these are trials? Let's try it. I have no idea how to play this character, but, you know, we'll learn it. Welcome to Erebus, the astral plane of the collective subconscious. In this vast expanse, all the souls of both the living and the dead are connected to one another. Out here, our memories, our emotions, and our deeds are laid bare. You see, no one exists within a vacuum. We all have an effect on another. Is it tutorial? Okay, cool. I figured it would be a tutorial of some sort. Wait, hold on. Are dashes crits, or am I tripping? Air attacks can combo into ground attacks? Dash attack skill crit. Okay, so this is the male counterpart to the Valkyrie, in other words. With that ability, at least. Oh, wait, you can combo. Wow. That's cool. I am the caretaker of the souls of Erebus. I nurture virtuous emotions while weeding out the negative ones. But sometimes an event can occur, one so catastrophic that the psychological trauma creates a scar across the lands. Left unresolved, these scars will poison the minds of future generations. The red memories you see in this world are called scars. Bring them to me and I will help you cleanse them. People tend to hide their darkest fears, which means which makes scars difficult to find. But I can hear their echoes, so to speak to me and I will guide you to them. Eurus' memory. Will the Traveler be strong enough to conquer a scar? It has been a long while since I've worked with the mortal, and the last time did not turn out well. But I must have faith. I have seen the Traveler triumph over many obstacles. However, the corruption caused by a scar is a different kind of beast. Scar discovered. A simple start. Alright. Is another hidden one? Oh, I don't think I can go back now. Sorry. <laughs> Stream latency. These traumas, these scars, I cannot resolve alone. I lack the ability to fully empathize with the struggles you mortals face every day. Come back for it later? Okay. And this is where you come in. I need the empathy of another mortal to help heal these lands. Your compassion can mend the world. I 
this game too cool though. The scars you face on your journey ahead are treacherous. They will push you to the skills to the limit. And in Erebus, physical strength can only take you so far. Your body will be constrained by your em empathic connection. But if you can improve your connection by finding empathies, you can reduce, maybe even remove these limits. Welcome to the top of the caldera, traveler. This mountain you've been climbing is my scar, and it continues to grow alongside my fear of failing to save the people. Down here, there has been so much pain and suffering. So many scars have grown wild, polluting the lands. Our traumas will be passed down and corrupt countless generations to come. These people deserve better. So what do you say? Will you help me bring closure to the Forlorn? I know it's a tall task, but this is a tall mountain. Plus, if you do well enough, I'll even give you a trophy. Everyone loves trophies. Yeah. Okay. I'm ending it. I get an S plus <laughs> plus. Interesting. All right. I think I want to get started on this run now. It's interesting, but oh, what are you doing here? Hey, you stranger! Thanks again for saving me on the bridge. Being cooped up in there for so long was making me go crazy. We've been down here for so long, waiting for help to arrive, that I had given up hope. Man, I know we're not out yet, but standing on these docks right here right now is probably the happiest I've ever been. I'd love to chill here some more, but I can't. There are still people in the kingdom that need help. The next time you go back to the kingdom, we should share a boat. It'll make it make for some nice company. Let's get this shit started. Well, there's clearly a scar right there. How do I... What do I... How do I get it? The golden doors in... You have to be a ranger to get that one? That sucks. Alright, let's see. Uh, here. That sucks! <laughs> you must be a ranger. Okay. Huh. Right, I went that way. Gotta remember that that exists. Does that hit enemy? It, it looks like it might actually hit enemies. It does, okay. Okay, watch out. Wolves. There's always wolves, right? Jay. You have a gift, Z. Stop wasting your talents trying to help everyone you meet. You could be working at the Citadel and making change from the inside. You don't have to suffer like this. If you fight, you'll die. Trust me, there's no winning this war. You have no idea how powerful Lamech is. It would take a hundred soldiers plus a miracle to stop him. Of course there are. Of course there's works. Forgive me. I don't know why I'm writing this. I love you, Z, but you must be open to compromise. I hope you don't hate me for what I'm asking. Yours, Jay. Hello. Amaterasu's son. That's a lot of resolve. Or monkey's paw. I, You know what? I want to see what this is. It's only going to cost me a little bit of health. I figured it'd be worth it. It's called Amaterasu's son. Master relic. Your weapon applies or extends... Burn for two seconds? Let's fucking go. Nice. Oh, dude, that's ham. That's crazy. I love it. And you could probably stack it. Yeah, in game time, that's ridiculous. Hold on. Ugh. Okay. Hold on. Yeah, I'd love to get that, but uh, that definitely requires a double jump or some kind of ability that I don't have. Yeah, I can see where you'd think that. Like Binding of Isaac. There we go. 
Like, I know I can get up there. Wait, hold on, let me see that again. Now nah, we good. Alright. Damn it. Alright, I got it, I got it. I got hit, but I got it. There's your damn wolves. Whoa, okay. I think it's probably the Japanese sun goddess. Yeah. Considering the burning thing, but that's so cool. Yo, the music in this area is cool, too. Reminded me of the Mummy Demastered. Gotta remember, I can't attack up anymore. I'm out of Valkyrie. Mmm, Mummy. Yeah, Amaterasu's son's a little OD. I like it. Hmm. Right, there's a chest down there. What's this spell like again? It's just a... Oh, it does that, though. That's good. Uh, 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 Stoofles. Everything burns. Oh, absolutely. They definitely show their influences. And there's nothing wrong with that, I think. I don't know that I could actually get that without taking damage. I, I almost did it, though. Hold on. Oh, ham. I'm ham. I'm too good. I'm OD. Owl sword? Yeah, that would be crazy good. Yeah, it's easy to guess when you haven't played a game, because you talk about, like, all the games you've played are the ones that you mention constantly. Alright, well, let's see what's up here. Watch out. Oh, God! They could do that when they're in the air. Gotta be careful. I like this character, though. Can I stand on these? No, okay. I think we're up to nine now. Sweet. Found a boss already? Holy shit. Okay. Acquires Ether's wings, huh? God. So I gotta find Ether's wings. She won't see anybody. She hasn't left the conservatory in months. You should stop wasting your time. Esther A. Nama won't open the door unless you have an offering. She demands two Lily of the Valley blossoms, but they are not easy to find. She has harvested most of them already. Good luck in your search. A gift in life. Alright, plus I can't get up there without what's clearly a double jump relic. I can't attack that wait, can I There we go. Not 
watch out. Can we spin? Oh, that's right! Why did I forget that? Alright. Mana's memory. My success has become my undoing. My brothers have blamed me for the rebellion and washed their hands of all responsibility. Lamech commands the guards and en Enoch supervises the spies, yet the failure to discover the rebels falls on me. They seek to provoke me. Their soldiers trample the undergrowth. They cut down the trees and they dig ditches to dispose their bodies. Everything I have done they seek to undo out of jealousy and spite. They left me no choice. Now I must oversee burials. They offer no support and mock my traditions. They pressure me to lower my standards. Oh shit. All right. Remove the broken metal lest it pollute the soil. Clean out the wounds lest sickness spreads through the people. Mourn the bodies of the young for they bore no children. Tend to my children as I tend to my forest. Pass down all trinkets for sentiment is needed. Honor those who are dead and dying. Pray for the poison. Pray. But the bodies won't stop coming. So not only am I going to need a double jump to get up to that boss, but I'm going to need these Lily of the Valleys. Fates die. Yeah, I don't know about all that. Yeah, I don't know why I forgot about the spin kick there. Oh, hello. I have? I didn't know that I seen a Lily of the Valley. Couldn't reach you with that. Oh, that's what that was. Okay. Is this going to be worth it? Probably not. Somewhat worth it. Whatever. I'm not mad. Watch out. And I got Leather Cape plus one. Looks like I've seen them all in this area then. Ah! I don't know how to avoid damage there, but... Fuck. Yes, I do want to hint on the double jump, actually. Oh, you can spin kick the arrows? Makes sense, actually. Wait, hold on. Look for a room running off to the right. Okay. Bro, okay. You know what? That's alright. Oh, watch out. You can kind of see where those guys are going to be. This is a room running off to the right, but I don't think that's it. And I got Warden's Cave. Oop, and all that. I figured it would be in this zone. Watch out. Hmm. Damn it, that's not what I was looking for. I also didn't press the right button. All right, fuck it, fuck it. I was trying to get up there, but... Damn it. Damn, wargs.
Oh, that's where Lily. Okay. I ain't getting up there anytime soon. All right. What do we have here? Oh, I know about the curious. Okay. okay. Pirate ship creates a flying pirate ship that you can freely move around, shoot stuff, and blocks mid-sized projectile. I have to try it, right? Okay. You know, I could use that to get the lily. I still want the double jump, but I'm just saying... Recently, I was looking through my daughter's phone. I've seen that. Recently, I was looking through my daughter's phone, and I found many pictures of a cartoon skeleton with one glowing blue eye wearing a hoodie. When I asked my daughter why she had such demonic images on her phone, she told me there was nothing wrong with it because it was from a video game. Lily of the Valley. Oh, but it, it costs resolve? But I, well, I gotta do it, right? It sucks that it costs resolve, but. I'd also like to go up there, but I have to recharge the thing. Ah, oh, really? Money. That's good, yeah. I'd like to try to get this one, like whatever's up here. Oh, I didn't see that. Damn it. Oh, no. This looks promising. Welcome to the Far Shores, Traveler. It's been a while since I've been here. Despite its history, the view is quite nice. What am I supposed to do here? Find the heirloom by the far shores. Location, Kerguelen Plateau, below the waterline. I've tethered a resident rope to the heirloom. Oh, wait, I see him. Yeah. Yes. Oh. Hark. I see. The others. 
You have done this before. I am Ether. I hold the power of Zephyr. That is all. Yo, here we go. And we got our full health, which is awesome, by the way. So we already have the double jump. All right, cool. None of that. All right. Oh, wow. Okay. Got it. That's my double jump, baby. That was cool. It was cool. Ether's wings in the air. Double jump. I saw the other lily of the valley, but might as well explore on my way back. Watch out. Oh, oh well, actually, there it is. Huh. A third one? Why is there a third one? They said we needed two, right? Huh. So they give you three? That's actually really good. All right. Let's get to the boss then. Oh, I keep forgetting to come back down. But I also want to see uh, what's up in here. Watch out. Sweet. That's actually good game design, though, that there's an extra one. I think I'm feeling like... Like, I'm really feeling like I'm getting, like, the hang of this game, you know? Wings, yep. And that opens because we. And we'll never have to gather the lilies again, right? Sweet. Alright, three bosses today. Can we beat this third one? Let's see. Your offering is accepted. The lilies have been taken and your sacrifice has been cleansed. The doors are now forever open to you. Oh my god, we're fighting Lily! <laughs> Estere Nama, the Keeper of the Forest. Alright, it's Lady Sauron. Watch out. I don't know what's gonna happen, but I'm sure it's not good!
Damn. Oh, watch out. Okay. The burning is doing a lot to help me here. Oh, watch out. Oh, didn't see that. Ah, pressed the wrong button. Oh, God. Oh, no, I'm getting hit there. Oh. I didn't know that. It would have been interesting. All right, we're we rack up the damage that I can. Oh boy. I get it. Oh. I don't think I'm surviving this. What the hell hit me there? Oh god. Damn. All right. You can calm... Oh, I completely forgot about calming nightmares. All right, I didn't have much health anyway. Bring the dullest up to rank two, though. I forgot that you could do that. All right. Knight. Mage. Barbarian. We haven't played as a knight in a while. Let's do it. It would have been good, but I don't think it would have been... It would, Blade Runner, you know. Calm her nightmarish tits. Alright, let me see. So the war drum. Every unique relic increases your damage by 4%. Nice. Shield of Thorns destroys mid-sized projectiles, breaks an enemy contact, knocking them away and applying Spore Burst. That sounds ham. How does it fire? Oh, okay, I see. It's a leaf shield. Alright. Oh, kid, looks like you found some advanced blueprints. Those are more than special. Because with this, I can upgrade existing gear, making them better than I ever imagined. Literally. Still gots me that Aphantasia. Want a secret? Want to hear a secret, kid? I hear if you wear items from the same set, you can unlock special unity bonuses that'll blow your mind. Stanley Kubrick. Oh, no, we don't want Kubrick to do that. No, 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 no. And if you keep upgrading your gear, those unity bonuses will keep getting better and better. So what are you waiting for, kid? Let's get spending. Alright, but it's not as good as what I'm using, it looks like. Oh no, Ward well, Warden Unity goes up. That's less weight. Yeah, you know what, why not? Just for the Unity? I don't know. <laughs> Geologist Camp. Examine furniture to discover rare materials. Those aren't the greatest geologists. Chance to randomly find ore and breakables. That sounds good. Do androids dream of electric feet? Oh, shit. Oh, that's ham. Sauna. Room full of stale air, suffocating heat, and naked dudes. Cool invention. Increases strength, waving, raising weapons damage. Wait, it still says affordable items. Like, what, what could I afford that... I don't know. Maybe something in there, but... I'm not worried about it right now. Jousting studies. There's no room for fainting. All you can do is brace for impact. You take reduced damage while dashing. Alright. Let's see. Face the heat. This is Foundry. Face the heat and test your metal by melting metals to make better metals. Gain bonus armor. Alright. I'm just unlocking shit. Alright, we good. Look at this basic bitch. 
attack, like, right? Basic bitch from the first game. You know how to, if you played the first game, you know how to play the knight. Yeah, I think, I think he did it perfectly. Taste the mate, not the height. Mm. Alright, well. Uh, taste the heat, not the meat. Oh. I'm sorry about that. He's new here. Okay. I uh, hope he'll become a custom ours again one day. I have portals in life for yeah, two, three, and five. It just happened to be like that. chest over there. Let's go that way, then. Hmm. Alright, there must be a secret somewhere. I'm not really seeing it, but... Maybe I can just put this on and sort of find it. There we are! Ah, let's see I was using your noodle. I know, right? It should be Spear Lesbian. Why not? Ah. Didn't go the way I wanted it to. He died as he lived, surrounded by idiots. No, oh, I thought I sucked them up. All right. No, oh. don't like you. Watch out. Hey now. I know, I was trying to be fancy. Leather Helm plus one. Okay, cool. Well, this is just going to be a Lily in the Valley, right? Well, is that what that is? No, that's something else. Oh, okay, I see what I could do. Alright. So kind of do like that, and then... Oh, oh almost, 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 almost. Clotho's Spindle, another fate. We had Clotho, and we had Atropos, so I gotta see that, like, Porthos gotta be in there, too. Uh, but I don't really have the resolve for this, so I don't know. It's a good one? Ah, fuck it, we'll go for it. You say it's good. Critical chance for spells and weapons increased by 10%. I would say that's definitely a good one. Worth the, the hit to health, I would say. Watch out. Oh, Lachesis? Oh, Porthos was a musketeer. My bad. Oh, hello. I didn't notice those guys. Yeah, exactly. Sanguine's K. Sweet. Why did this come up? I didn't press no button like that. Hmm. 
Seems like all the fate ones are good, huh? Nama's memory. It has been a hundred days since the monsters arrived on the bridge and the gates were closed. For one hundred days we have carried out our duties. We have nursed the wounded and rationed our food. Why she look like Lady Sauron? One hundred days have passed and now the eternal summer has faded. The ashen snow continues to fall but instead of nourishing the soil it suffocates the land. The earth is cold and the forest bows under the weight. If supplies don't arise soon all the villagers will perish. And without them, my forest and centuries of careful stewardship will be gone. Sounds rough, lady. I'm still going to have to kick your ass. Nah. I knew what it was, too. But Lotus Petal increases your total mana pool by 50. You'll... I don't know. I'll lose a lot of health. Well, we found the boss already. I'm willing to give it a shot. Now, did I already look at this or not? You proxy his memory. She won't see anybody. She hasn't left the conservatory in months. You should stop wasting your time. Esther and Nama won't open the door unless you have... Oh, yeah, yeah, all right. We knew this. All right. Four dollars. And... Ba-da-ba-da! Warden Helm! Sweet. Let's try it. Hello, watch out. Ugh. Really? Watch out. least make this area safer. Come on down here. Okay. Just the, it's the crown. She looked like Saren. Sauron. I'm kind of kicking her ass a little bit here. To be honest. Watch up. Damn it. I wasn't paying attention there. Dead. Sal mom. Bro. That wasn't that bad. It was harder than the second boss. A lot 
easier than the first boss. And I got Harvest and Home. Dude, are we just like ripping through this game? That first boss was so hard compared to the second and third ones. We're just ripping through this. Oh, this game rules though. All right. Never could accept Nama as an estuary. She was one of the good ones. It's easy to make exceptions after condemning a group. It took me a long time to realize that everyone's an exception. Oh. Maybe I should go back to the beginning because I don't know where Area 4 is. Right? But, uh, I should look for it. I know where Area 5 is. <laughs> oh, no, you know, and but I, I definitely will do all that stuff, probably off-stream, to be honest with you, like, on my own time. I, I'm happy with it. It's just... I felt last week that I was taking a long time to adjust to playing it compared to the first game. But it feels like I'm really getting in the groove of playing this, you know? Alright. So I don't know what direction the fourth area is in, but we'll figure it out. Oh wait, there was a chest. Wow. Alright. There's a chest. And I wanna... Oh, I don't have mana for it. Alright. Well, let's do this. I'll have plenty of mana after this, right? Oh, my bad. Yeah, give me that. I really don't want to take that. It's cool and all, but I don't, I don't think so. Ooh, what is this? Empathy improved. A simple start. Your, empath your empathic connection has been improved. The max handicap for the scar challenge has been raised. Sweet. Oh yeah, I might do that, actually. I don't know how worth it that was, but, you know, completionists be completionists. I... I think that might be what actually winds up happening, you know? Hello? Also, um, the first game was great, but this one actually, it has better controls, you know what I mean? So that actually makes it a little easier because the controls are so good. Oh, hello. Alright. And there we go. A trick rune. Parkour with purpose. Gain mana when you spin kick an enemy. Yeah, the first game played great. This game plays better, right? We went from great to better.
Lots of health. Hello. Lots of health. Like, I never would imagine taking out two bosses in a row like that, you know? <laughs> you never know. Plus 23, though, damn. I don't know, it goes that high. At least to 101. Wow. Let's see, is this going to be Area 4? Yeah, it is. Stygian Study. And the Pizza Girl's here. Sweet. Okay. Zoomed out. That's fine. Now we can just skip here. Pizza! So what is the... Oh, like, you walk off it, but you could... Oh, okay. Alright, I'm learning. True ending Christ plus eight. No. All right. Well, that like this. There we go. Oh, okay. Damn, you could, yeah. Sanguine Helm, all right. Me! This looks dangerous. What happens when... Okay, it's like that. It's like the first game. Oh, it's a... All right, we found the mimics. I gotta pay attention to whether or not the chests are- Oh! Evil coins? Alright. That's also a mimic. Okay. Learning things. Ammonite weapon. All right, we're seeing a lot of stuff from the first game that we haven't seen yet in this game. Oh. Oh, right, right, right. Pencil sharpener guns, you're right. In a weird way, you're right. I could do things. Oh, God. 
That's awful. Uh, uh. I'm gonna get killed if I'm not careful. That's another thing, the soundtrack in the first game, great. Soundtrack in this game, even better. I just want to see if there's any secrets, but it doesn't look like it. Alright. I need health badly, but it's alright. Everything, including whatever the hell Moogle is. Sanguine weapon. Alright. Such a weird enemy, and it's just called Slug. Somebody once told me, Moogle that you're a character from a children's story about whatever the hell you are. It's a very big, impressive room, but... Well, I was trying to keep her name out of it, but yeah. Enoch's Notes. Properties of the Black Root and their future applications. You sift through the documents when you find an earmarked page. Eureka! I've discovered the transitive properties of black roots that can be used to bind objects to a person's soul. After some lengthy experimentation, I've successfully bound the souls of High Scholar Murmur and the Gonghead twins to my study doors. Note to self, stop calling Athen Athanasia and Zoe the Gongheads. They're still family after all. Their collective life force now ensures the doors remain impenetrable even to the craftiest of locksmiths. Truly fascinating. The possible applications of this discovery are endless. Right. I could bind my siblings to the golden door and free the need for soldiers to stand guard. Or I can bind a soul to a treasure chest and create a perfect assistant. I could even bind a soul to an eggplant and make it walk around. Yeah, it does. I was thinking Breath of Fire as well. And I guess I'll just make a really complicated door lock. Alright, so... Cursor's lock, all right. Where am I? I don't even see it in here. Precursor's lock. Oh, there it is up there. I'll open the doors to, to Enoch's study. Location Stygian study. Unlock Enoch's study by defeating the guardians. All right. So I gotta find these guardians. Guardian, guardian, guardian of the blind. Definition of shifts and anchors. Definition of shift. Shifting is when a set of rooms, buildings, and even landscapes suddenly become displaced within the kingdom. Initially a rare occurrence, these events have become increasingly more common with each passing year. Definition of anchors. Is an eggplant wizard, there has to be a twist. <laughs> anchors are special locations within the kingdom that seem immune to the effects of the shift. These include the entrance to Citadel Agartha, the Sun Tower Summit, the Far Shores, and the entirety of Ax Mundi, before the rebellion and destruction of the bridge. Refer to note the room problem. Uh, the room problem in visual agnosia. During a shift, massive chambers may be moved thousands of steps away from their original location. This has precipitated what researchers call the room problem. How does a room know it's a room? Why do rooms always connect cleanly rather than merge into a grotesque mess? We believe we know the answer. I found the law room, yeah, right? The room problem was partially solved during a visit to the villager in the Kerguelen Plateau who had reported that objects in his house had fused together in a formless way. The villager suffered from visual agnosia the inability to categorically recognize an object, which means he had difficulty identifying a table as a table. Interestingly, the only objects that fused were the man's most personal affects, which he kept in a private room. The moment I entered and observed the objects, however, their fusing stopped. It is as if there is a collective conscious unconsciousness in the world that determines what a room is and what a room isn't. But this raises more questions. Is the identity of an object solely reliant on the observer or the subconscious's groupthink? 
As more observers become aware of a room, does the room become more vulnerable to the shift? Is this why Lamech's hidden chamber seems immune to shifting? Only he and I know where it is, and we both- well, I found that already. And we both have a very concrete understanding of what it is, thus it never changes. So apparently I could get in there if I defeat the two guardians, huh? Alright, well. I thought that might be one of the guardians there. Does this hurt me or- oh god, now I know. Alright. I had to know. Oh, okay. That helps. Kid Icarus was alright. So it sounds like to get in there, you have to fight two mini-bosses. A Javelin Maiden? Oh my god. Oh god. Oh uh, boy. Ah, oh well. I'm guessing you get the heirloom by... Oh, the boss... Okay, that requires an heirloom. All right, well, we'll find that heirloom. All right, let's see. We've got a ranger, a knight, and a... I want the ranger. We haven't played as one in a while, and there's that one scar that was, you know, required a ranger. Let's check this out, though. Let's see what we got. All right, magma mass, some of them, all right. Zealot's ring spells cast while at max magic point deal an additional 25% damage. And Vanguard's banner, epic relic, dash increases a wave that destroys mid-sized projectile. Oh, right. Oh! Oh, shit! <gasps> Looking snazzy, kid. You keep coordinating like that, and maybe you'll find that special someone. And if you don't, well, at least you'll still look great. It's more than just pride what keeping unity in your clothing. Why would this be less than this? Oh, because of the... Yeah, but I should go up to that anyway, I think. It's because the unity. Is it... Why is everything worse? I don't know. It looks like that's the best weapon right now. That's shitty. No, oh, stop talking to me. All right. Can I get something? Let's see. Here it is. Trick Ruin. Parker of Purpose Game on him when he's been kicking enemy. All right. Cool. Yeah, it seems that way. Everything's worth Fighting ring. It's called a ring, but it's actually square. Unlocks boxers. Alright, the gloves are metal. These guns are always loaded. Punch your foes to build up your combo, then turn everything into a pinball wonderland by launching fools into other fools. Sounds like my kind of shit, but I want to get that scar. Remember, the enemy of your enemy is your projectile. The ranger may not be my favorite, but I want to... You said I needed to be a ranger to get to that. Balrog shall pass. Oh, do I gotta shoot it or use my talent while the? Oh! Oh, well, that got me close enough. Gregory's memory. Lamech's protege is dangerous. He will soon surpass his teacher. That type of power cannot be trusted. Z convinced him to join our cause, but Jay is still citadel-born. Still a master's lapdog. He turned once, he'll turn again. Scar discovered. Two masters. Alright, sweet. Stevie and Sonny. I'm not the biggest fan of this character, but... Twin Lamech fight? Mm. Oh, 
Watch out. Okay. Nah, I was trying to avoid it. Oh, what? Oh wait, can I, I can just stand on it? Well, alright, I was standing on it, but okay. I was kind of standing on the spike, you know? Damn. It looked like I was on the spike, yeah. I'm sure there are people that are like really good with the ranger. But that person ain't me. Oh god, I might as well. Ugh. Ugh. Oh, well. There was no way. All right. I think it's a good place to stop, though, guys. I had a lot of fun. We had a hype train, which is always extremely exciting. But I think uh, we're going to stop for the day. We're going to go over the schedule for the next week or so. And then we're going to do a raid. We made so much progress, right? Like... I feel like I made more progress today than I have in like, you know, like three Rogue Legacy 1 streams. It was a really good stream, yeah. It was it was so cool. All right. All right. Okay, so here we go. Uh, let's see. Tomorrow afternoon, really fun stuff. We got Pokemon Diamond version for the DS. Thursday night. We got, uh, no, not that. We got Bahamut Lagoon for the Super Famicom. This game seems really good. Looking forward to more of that. Friday afternoon, we may have beaten Dragon Quest IV, but we haven't really beaten it. There's a post-game chapter, and we're going to be continuing along through Chapter VI. Uh, that's Friday afternoon. Saturday night, we got more of Suikoden V for the PS2. Sunday night, we got more of East 8 Lacrimosa of Donna for uh, Steam. Monday afternoon, we got the very last bit of Super Street Fighter 2 Turbo for PlayStation, and I don't have a scene set up yet, but the next game is Darkstalkers, which I'll probably be playing the arcade version, unless there's like a really, really good home version, but I'm probably going to go with the arcade version uh, for uh, for Darkstalkers. Uh, Tuesday night, a week from today, Tampon Tuesday, we got Rogue Legacy 2 for Steam, a game that I gotta say is totally ham. I gotta, I gotta try that boxer. 
Because if you were saying that the Boxer and the Barbarian was like your favorite, and I like the Barbarian, but I want to try out the Boxer. But you know what my favorite is so far. You know my favorite is definitely 100% the Valkyrie. The Valkyrie is amazing. But let's go over here. And uh, let's see who we have online that we could raid. Let's see. Uh, there's a lot of people on. You know what? I don't get to raid Amethyst Corn that often. Let's do it. She's playing Little Nightmares. She's really good people. So we'll head over there. This is so dumb. So dumb, but she's going to like it. Oh, you itchy boy, Gibbsy. Guys, there's your raid call. Copy and paste it as we head into Amy's stream. She is playing Little Nightmares. So let's head over there. I'll see you guys on her stream. I'll see you guys on Discord. I'll see you guys tomorrow afternoon for Pokemon Damon version. And I'll see you around in general. And away we go.